help Biafra. This is Biafra Liberation Army Network coming to you again. Please do subscribe, like, share, and comment. There is a serious one here. Good morning, my people. Welcome back to Victory Voice TV, where you get all those news that matter to us. Yes, this one matters. Yes, when somebody is working, when you are working, definitely you is. That's how God made it. Uh, but something brought me to this video is um, Simon Eba, a prime minister that posted it. He said, he said, um, a girl of people named their capital Eba. <laughs> And people, the the people that mock, they are mocking, seriously mocking, laughing. But that is how it starts. When anybody works, there is always a good reward for every good work. Remembering that these people are being killed and they need to defend themselves. Giving them morale, not that you will fight for them, but let them gather together and fight for themselves. Giving them training that they need. Giving them weapons and everything they need to fight for themselves, make them to think, oh, if we truly have this place we call a gala to be our own, then the capital will be named Epa because it is actually the Epa that gave us, uh, you know, that freedom. And mockers are busy mocking, laughing at themselves, not knowing that every big thing that you see today started very small. It started like a dot. That's how life is. Don't neglect the days of your little beginning. And don't bite the finger that feed you when you, are, when you were hungry. You see, that's how life is. Simon Epa is actually bringing different dimension to this struggle. In fact, he's a very fierce human being. Fearless. Fierce. Fierce. When I mean very forceful. It is false that they understand not pleading. When you are pleading with Nigerian, uh, the jihadists, no, no, no. You are just pouring water on stone. And a very shiny stone at that. Not stone that can take a bit of water, no. A very glassy stone that doesn't take water. That is where you are pouring your water and that's a waste of time. The only thing they understand is gun to gun. Man to man. And they fear guns too much. If they notice that you have sophisticated weapons, they start running from you. But if you don't have sophisticated weapons, every week they will plan attack. If they plan attack in this kindred today, next tomorrow they will plan in the next kindred. So they want to finish every living being, their man, women, animals, and they destroy. They take over what does not belong to them and they displace them. That is what has been happening to Bokos and the... Uh, or this Egana, this uh, middle belt. You know, because nobody is speaking for them. The kind of leaders they have is the kind of Ohanese and Ibo that we have in Ibo land. But our own is different. Different because we have Ohamadike who taught us for five years. Who, who, who washed our brain from, from uh, intimidations they've been giving us for a very long time. Because this propaganda you are seeing is, is actually a big tool. They use propaganda on us. They used intimidation on us. When they kill a particular village, the next village will run away and they will take over, they will occupy. And they will intimidate you to surrender. You will just come and beg them to please take over your land and please be the leader. And then please give you a uh, pipe guide line. Uh, no, pipe guide guard so that you be their may guard i tell you that is what osari dokubo is uh is uh, suffering and the topolo his brother and the rest of those that are calling them sir they have surrendered their god-given resources because they are saboteurs they never supported good things and good things will never come to them it's not a cause they brought it to themselves life is like that life is like that when you support good things good things will come your way but when you always castigate and you don't support good things, it will never come your way. Let's take a look on the map. The map is this. It's very simple. It's a state of Egala map. Lokoja, Omala, Okechi, Basa, Mpa, Ampa, um, Olama Boro, Egala Emele, and uh, Aje Okuta. Okene, Ebaji, 
Ada, Olu, and then the capital they say is Ekpa. You understand? Yes. Then the mockers mock themselves. We are moving. That was how they started mocking that Ekpa is a criminal, that Eberima, that thing in Finland. That thing has given them woto woto sleepless nights. Even the content they are creating, that thing in Finland is giving it to them. So he's feeding them invariably. You can't run away from the truth. The truth, another dimension has been given to Biafra struggle. We are no longer ranting. Yes, before they, they see us as people that rant and cannot do anything, as people that they can kill at any time and nothing will happen, this time around they are the ones crying. Then we can now buy them and nothing will happen. Yes, they can't try the mess they are doing in just in our region. They can't do it. Yes. Number one, those people that will try it, they will not go back with their legs. They will, they will cry there. You understand? My dear, all heads na head, and every head can roll. I keep telling my people, when they are intimidating you with guns, my dear, you need guns. That's the only thing that can stop the intimidation. And not just carrying guns. When you, when you use the all answer, use it, use it very well on them. When you see them, buy them and don't cry. Don't look back because they've actually come to buy you. But because you see them first, just do the buying. First of all, when you do it, my dear, Onyaha Nago and others will learn from that because nobody actually wants to die. Uh, no human being wants to die, even the sick ones. They don't want to die because they believe tomorrow may be better. You understand? So taking, taking lives like that, just be killing innocent people, villagers that, that have been hungry for a very long time. You now in, suddenly invade their community and you start shooting, start killing, you start beheading, you start using dagger, you start using this, you start using us, breaking their heads and you feel it will work. When you want to kill innocent people, God will not allow you to go scot-free. Honestly speaking, never. Because that's just the truth that is the truth my dear people that is the truth so we can't keep deceiving ourselves all in the name of one nigeria one nigeria is a scam it is because of that one nigeria that they have stopped you from doing exploit even your economy is down nothing is working everything is in shambles everything is just messed up and they, they are telling you one Nigeria. And you keep believing in mirage. It's a mirage. You can't get to the end of it. Nigeria? No, 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 no. Nigeria is a mirage. It's not real. It's not real. When you think you're getting closer, it will go deeper. So the earlier you quit going, the better for you. Just quit going. It's not working. Simple and short. It is not working. Okay? So, my dear people, that's the news we have for you right now. I know you will make it to go viral for me. Just share and like. God bless you all.